Okay, welcome back to DaVinci Resolve Tips and Tricks. Today, I want to export this still image from my timeline into a JPEG so I can use that in social media. Or just put it on my wall because it's such a great looking face. So how do we do it? Normally in Premiere, there's a little button here which you can just click and export. Um, it's pretty straightforward. There's also a keystroke. Uh, there's none of that here. There might be a keystroke but uh, I haven't found it so far. So here's the workaround as far as I can make out. Go to color. So first of all, select the frame you want. I want this one. I like the text. I like the beautiful look on that man's face. I go to the color tab, which comes up with um, exactly where, uh, where I am on the timeline. I right click, I grab a still, and still pops up in the gallery. I right click, I right click the um, still again and this time I want to export that image. The whole point of this is that you can export your grades uh, with your LUTs or etc etc and you can bring them back in and, and, and play with the color later, later on but all we want to do right now is just export that still image including the text. So we click on export. Here I have handily previously uh, arranged uh, where I want to drop it. Um, if you have a look Let's get rid of DPX. If we get rid of that file first, it comes down with all your different options, PNGs, uh, TIFFs, BMPs, etc., etc., Cineon files. I want to export as a JPEG. And then we're going to type in B-roll graphics. Uh, graphics. Maybe we'll do FX like that. Graphics. Let's just do it like that. That's simple. Export. We export that. That's done. Now, if we go to our um, to our folder, you'll see that it's there. Um, it does create an additional file. Oh, Windows! What are you doing, Windows? Let's just move this over here a little bit. Uh, double click on that. There you go. There should be. There you go. All done. It's a bit of a dick and dick and dick move, really. A bit of a workaround. Would be nice if it was just a button that we could just export that single frame from the timeline where we're at, either, either the basic edit or the quick edit timeline. A little button there would save so much time. That's fast review, does not. So this, you know, give us the option to put something in there. Um, it's a minor gripe, but it would certainly speed things up. Blackmagic, if you're listening, put a button there. Give us a choice. Uh, or if there is a button that we can choose, uh, let me know in the comments so I can correct my mistake. And that's it. Quick little tip how to export a still image from your timeline into a JPEG or any kind of image that you want. I hope that helps. Um, more to come as I find little problems. Bye-bye.